Hello and welcome to this checkmate in two chess puzzle. I see that black just has the king and two pawns left. White has the king, two rooks, two knights and a bishop. It's white's turn. And can you get a checkmate in two? If you take the pawn on b5 with the rook, the king has an escape square and you can't get a checkmate in two this way, but you can move in to a checkmate in three. And if the king moves to c6, you can then move in the knight, forces the pawn push, and then move in with the bishop to checkmate in three, but not two. If you take the pawn on b5 with the bishop, the king can escape. You can take the pawn with the knight, which means that the king can move. You can get a checkmate in four after a couple more moves. Taking the pawn on e6 doesn't get you a checkmate in two. The king has several escape squares, and you can't follow up. With a checkmate in two. Again, eventually you can move in for quite a nice checkmate in four. Let's take a look at the solution to this one. So pause the video if you need more time. So the way to get the checkmate in two for this one is actually to move the knight to a8. The king moves to a6. You can checkmate in two by moving the rook to a4. The king moves to a5. You can checkmate in two by moving the rook to a7. And if the king moves to c6, you can take the pawn with the bishop to checkmate in two. Okay, that's the end of this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you again soon.